Hey there, Trisha Turner here. Want to get out and give you guys a quick uh, market update as I've been trying to keep you educated as much as I possibly can during this ever-changing world of real estate. So as of May 1, the interest rates are hovering right around 6.4 to 6.6 .6 in some markets. We do know some people are able to buy down that rate. I even heard of one being bought down to 4.9. And of course, that's a whole nother conversation and a whole nother video that would depend on what your price point is and so forth. But what I do know is that the real estate market definitely has cooled off again. You know, we were anticipating and still not 100% sure, but we were anticipating a good report coming out May 10th, which would definitely bring interest rates down some. However, those projections were before all of these banks started collapsing and having problems and the world went into a whole different weird space. And if you think about when COVID hit um, a couple of years ago, no one saw that coming either. And what the heck was that? It changed real estate dynamically. It made it go crazy. We had a frenzy in the real estate world and people were, you know, putting in multiple offers on property, paying way over list price, paying, you know, draining their savings account in the 401ks to get into properties because they were having to use cash craziness. Well, guess what? That cooled off. Uh, last year started in June here in Houston, Texas. And then in September, it was really low. And in the fourth quarter, we came to pretty much a screeching halt in a lot of areas. January picked back up a little bit because we saw a sudden dip in the real in the interest rate, not much. And we've been riding this roller coaster of the interest rate the entire year for 2023 so far. So can I tell you that things are going to get better? I cannot. I could tell you um, about five weeks ago that I anticipated things were getting really better and going to get better for the summer. However, I'm not going to say that now. I am going to say that, good Lord, we don't have a crystal ball and we just keep seeing things that we've never seen before. I do believe interest rates will eventually come back down. I don't think the report on May 10th is going to give us that data now just because of all the banks and all the dilemma that we're in right now as a country and in our financial system. So here's what I do know. We do know that 85% of homes sell for a life change, death, divorce, babies, empty nesters, you name it, job transfers and so forth. Those things are still happening. Is it a good time to sell? Absolutely, if you need to sell. Because here's what I believe is that your home today may not be what it is worth today in about six months. We may see things shift in the fall and the winter, depending on what happens in the next couple of months. And as you know, as we move into an election year, which we're still far away from, it's like a year and a half from now, those things tend to get worse during an election year. So if you're thinking about real estate, now is definitely the time to sell. I do believe, though, that there are people out there with um, a lot of intelligence and a lot of wealth. They have money and people are tired of losing their money in the stock market and they're tired of losing their money at the banks and they don't trust the banks. So I do believe 1000 percent that real estate is your safest, soundest investment. You can touch it, feel it, flood it, burn it down, whatever. But it's yours to touch, see, control. And when you can have control over a financial asset, I definitely believe you're ahead of the game. So I'm running values on properties every day right now to help people fight their taxes and at least educate people. Like, this is what your home is worth today. This is what it was worth six months ago. This is what it may be worth in six months from now. I don't have a crystal ball, but I do study this stuff and I'm, I'm obsessed with it because I need to be. I have a family to take care of and a business to run. So if you'd like to know what your current value is, definitely reply to this email. If you're a real estate agent and no one has taught you how to do this stuff, please reach out to me. I'm a real estate broker and I've been doing this for over 20 years. I can help you. So times are changing. Yes, times are not great for a lot of reasons, but you know what? Real estate's always safe and, all, and always um, you can protect what's going on with your asset. So if you want more info about your asset or thinking about buying an asset, talk to me, reach out to me or one of the members of our team because they are highly skilled. Have an awesome day. I will update you after the May 10th reports come out and let you know what that looked like. But for now, all is good and will continue to be good if you believe in all things that are great. All right. Have a good day. Bye.